Well, also tonight at 5 o'clock, you know when you send your kids off to college, you expect for them to be safe. But already this school year, there have been two sexual assaults on campuses, one at IUPUI and another at Ball State University. Our crime Bureau reporter Steve Jefferson is in Muncie this evening after speaking with students on both campuses today. Steve? Andrea, when a student reported being attacked in this dorm building you see behind me, uh, the police here on campus sent an alert, a text message to all of the students that went out campus wide. Ball State University detectives, they're actually investigating the attack that happened on August 25th to a female student here on campus. The attack happened on the women's floor of the campus apartment building. Although investigators will not release the circumstances surrounding the attack to protect the victim, they do want students to know about it so they are on alert. Camps, campus police at IUPUI are dealing with the same type of investigation. And more recently, a female student reported being attacked inside a dorm building on Limestone Street. Students say knowing about the attacks helps them not take their own safety for granted. I really appreciate that I live on a campus that makes it well known that these things do happen and that there's ways to prevent it. Um, and it was really helpful to hear that they're going to put that information out just so people know. Do you feel safe? Yeah, absolutely. I feel very safe on campus. Then I like to keep my phone ready, you know, in case I need to call 911 really quickly. Sometimes if it's really late, I like to be on the phone with my mom just to be like, hey, you know, I'm walking, I'm safe. And that's kind of the steps I take to keep safe, too. Since details of the investigation here at Ball State University and the attack at IUPUI are confidential, we don't know if the perpetrator is someone who actually lives on campus or is someone uh, who basically visited the campus uh, and committed the attack itself. Either way, Andrea, police are urging students to stay alert and to pay close attention to the alerts that they send so they can keep themselves safe. Back to you in the studio. All right, Steve Jefferson reporting tonight from Muncie. Thank you.